Welcome to the video, my friends. Today, we're going to check out Agent 64 Spies Never Die. I've had this game on my radar and installed the demo on Steam for quite some time, but I'm only just getting around to checking it out. From what I've seen on the Steam page, this game seems inspired by the classic 90s console shooters made by Rare, like GoldenEye and Perfect Dark, which were great games back in their day, but these days on that N64 controller, not so great. So it'd be good if they've managed to transfer this to keyboard and mouse. I've got a controller next to me as well to try if we want to. This is developed by Replicant D6 and runs on the Unity engine, just as an FYI, and will be coming to early access at some point soon. So let's, let's just jump in and uh, check out this tower map. Uh, let's go special agent. We'll jump straight in for you guys. Oh, we got like a VHS filter or something. I imagine some settings will be in the options menu to disable this stuff. You can see very much that uh, rare in inspiration. So we got that weird floaty movement of the gun in the center of the screen, just like those old games had. We had to move the gun to the edge of the screen to move the actual screen around. So I could see this being very strange but it actually feels quite nice so i'm using keyboard and mouse at the moment uh let's see in our display settings what we've got so we're running 14 40 fps unlimited uh crt effect off uh let's try with the crt effect off should have a okay that looks good oh i do like the crt effect Get some of these bad guys. Surprisingly, works well. Not having a cursor. I can hit my targets with some pretty good accuracy. So we're unarmed and we've I think we picked up a new gun actually. The Viper. Classic gold night trick. Shoot off the lock. take out these just quickly so as you know i've been around for a while been gaming since the late 80s through the 90s so i have grown up with the old games like golden eye and played those a lot actually we on on the couch co-op and couch split screen on golden eye specifically deathmatch with mates when you, you finish school when you go home rush home and grab a controller each and play uh, deathmatch against each other and uh, friendships were made and friendships were broken definitely in those days so this brings back memories they never saw me coming oh oh got some ammo now for the viper oh that was a sneaky guy hiding behind these boxes Press Q, quick items, and launch decoder to access the box. Awesome. Thought we'd let him finish on the toilet. Should have got plenty of ammo now for our vipers so let's bring those out and we'll push through this next door here oh wait i think those were our teammates
I have got the music on in the background as well. I did. Oh, God. Nearly shot the hostage. <laughs> it has got very similar beats to Goldeneye. Oh, yep. I killed a hostage. It does have some kind of aim assist, which I can't seem to turn off. I thought I was a good aim, but it's the game, not me. <laughs> it gave me a false sense of skill. So stealth kills don't seem to work from behind. All right, let's see if we can rescue these hostages without fault this time. Ah, there we go. Can you open the door on the ground floor? Sure, follow me. Let's go. I'll get the door for you, buddy. Don't you worry. Oh, sneaky. I could have so easily lost the mission there. Those guys just jumped out of that room. Thank you. Now I'm totally not bothered if he dies. I got what I wanted. One over there. I see one in the pillars here. Is that the exit? We just walk out of that black void there. Mission accomplished. So I think it's just that one mission. And if I am correct, uh, this is made by one person. Uh, so I do like to cover games that are made by one person. It's a good trip down memory lane as well. You know, it takes us back to the N64 days of Goldeneye and Perfect Dark. That's not bad. I'll keep an eye on that. Definitely. I'll leave links in the description as always below for you to check out. Let me know your thoughts on Agent 64. Have you played it? Are you looking forward to it? Or is it just not your thing? Is this kind of not aged very well? This kind of FPS with the movement where you've got to move the mouse freely in the middle of the screen, the gun, as you move it to the edge of the screen to turn. Does it just feel off to you now? Let me know in the comments below. Don't forget to hit that like button as it helps a lot. Subscribe if you want to see more of the content I create. Thank you for watching and I'll see you peeps next time. <laughs>